He's dying. Do you have allergies? Oh, that sucks. Hey! Hey! Howdy, folks. I'm live. Hello. Hello, welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream, you guys. Hello, 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 hello. Um, cute jacket, thanks. Who's my grandma's? Box dude, thank you for the 10 gifted subs. Thank you so much. Box dude, thank you for the 10. Is that a spider flash? Yeah, it, was, it came in the P.O. box. Blue egg and ham. Thank you for the four months. Uh, box dude said it's Gen Z here. I'm very suspicious, y'all. <laughs> thank you. Wow. Box dude, thank you for the sub. Logan, thank you. Um, Lazy Goose. 96, got a new bird. 96, thank you for the 36 months. Cheese fake. Baron, thank you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Who's the guy behind you? That's Chase. He's new intern. Kirasha. Kirasha. Thank you. Um... Oh, guys, check out my sleeve. Look at this. Look at it. It's Tico and Miley and Mia and Siren. Dude, I'm tatted up. First time chatter said nah. Okay, actual hater. That's really weird of you. Um, real tattoos? Uh, and no. Explain. Thank you for the two months. Here's my explanation. Spacebot, uh, color printer, and temporary tattoo paper, and we're handing temporary tattoos out at TwitchCon wow. at our meet and greet. So there's like, there's so many different ones. Look, there's Tico, and there's um, Appa, oh, <gasps> a little isopod. The logo. Oliver. Stompy plushie. This is the first time I've wanted to be in America. <laughs> oh wait, this one's my favorite. Look at this. Based. Thank you for the two months, Pappers. Biangle, Be not Alyssa. Thank you, guys. Um, yeah. Um, so that's that's what we're doing. We're handing those out at TwitchCon. I'm excited. Space, you ready? Yeah. All right. Um, before we start uh, all the shenanigans, um, all the keeping stuff, um, I am sponsored today. Um, oh, nice. I was going to do that. Did you change the title? Yes. Okay, cool. Um, I'm sponsored today by Holeskern. Yes, uh, we talked about them last time. Um, you guys saw they sent me some stuff. I'll show you what they sent me. Ouch. Um, Holeskern is... Uh, it was founded as a small family business in Austria. And all of their products are partially made from natural materials. 
Um, all of the wood that they use is FSC certified, which is very cool. Um, and FSC certification ensures that products come from responsibly managed forests that, certif that provide environmental, social, and economic benefits. Um, FSC stands for Forest Stewardship Council. Thank you for gifting. Um, Forest Stewardship Council's mission is to promote environmentally sound, socially beneficial, and economically prosperous management of the world's forests. Their vision is that they can meet our current needs for forest products without compromising the health of the world's forests for future generations. And they sent me some things, and I will show you. Holzkern has watches, they have jewelry, they have bags, they have um, earrings, they have necklaces. Um, they come in these cool little boxes, FSC certified wood boxes. They're Magnetic. Wow. And look at this. Oh. I took it off the thing because I, I wore it yesterday. <laughs> so it's normally packaged nicer, but I just put it back in this box. Look, it's a necklace. Beautiful. Please fix the collar here. Let me just. We don't. Thank you for the. Jato! J2. J2. Thank you for the 17 months. Um, Super Duper Egg. Thank you for the 28 months. Pretty necklace, okay? And also, pretty earrings. Look at them. Wow, hooray. You guys wanna see, you want close up of earrings? I actually have not tried these ones on yet. I wore the other ones last week. Is it focused? Can you see? I don't know. You kind of just have to guess and then stab your ear until it, you know, like that. Let me do the other side. Stab until just kind of, yeah. <laughs> what do you think? They are really pretty. Um, pretty, pretty earrings. Beautiful, amazing. Wow. Oh my god, cute. Um, so they have a lot of really great gifts. It is. Approaching that time of year, people, just so you know. Um, the holiday season, if you will, also for some reason, I don't know if it's just me or also y'all, but everyone in my life and their mom and their brother and their best friend has a birthday in the last three months of the year. I don't know what's up with that, uh, but if you guys have the same thing, then you might want to check them out. Um, you can go to holzkern.com slash mayahiga or use code maya15 um, when you're checking out at, at holzkern.com. Um, they have watches, they have jewelry, they have sunglasses, um, and they have unique cases is what they're called. Um, they sent me a faux leather uh, purse, and it looks like wood, but it's made out of cellulose, um, or the inside is made out of cellulose instead of leather, which is what the faux leather is, which is very cool. Um... And they offer free express worldwide shipping from Vienna, and custom fees are on them. So, you guys can do command Holzkern, um, or go to holzkern.com slash mayahiga, or use code maya15. Valentine's Day babies, wait a second. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, well, I will be wearing this jewelry for the rest of the day today, um, even though they didn't ask me to do that, because I actually really like it. <laughs> they let me pick it, and I was I genuinely really like it. So I'm going to wear it and hope that Snoppy doesn't kill me. Thank you, Holzkern, for sponsoring the stream. Um, that's it for the sponsored portion today. Thank you, guys. Um, and now we will begin.
Did you find the legs for your shorts? Yeah, thanks for noticing. <laughs> I did. I zipped them on this morning. Visiting the wolf conservation site. Oh, cute. Yeah, tell them I said, tell them I sent you. That's great. Thank you for the sub. Lady LaRocco2020, T Fries, Super Duper Egg, Bison. Thank you guys for the subs. Um, guys, Connor is, uh, Connor has to cameraman today because Flip is sick. And he's really excited Ooh. about it. I really like your Kim Possible cosplay. People will never get over that, will they? The Kim Possible and the Laura, Laura Croft thing. It's every time I stream. Who's Connor? I mean Chase. People Pog. Swooter. Thank you. Guys, the plan for today how do you how do you feel about the title by the way? Do you like having the title like that instead of just saying keeping? It's a new it's a new test. Yeah, okay, cool. Um so the plan for today, muck. Show Winnie's incredible recall prowess with the cowbell. Jordis Hugh draws. Thank you for the five gifted subs. Thank you so much. Thank you for the two months. Um, scoop poop. Cow training. Um, chicken training. We're going to see if Oliver can pick uh, out of the cauldron, pick names out of the cauldron, because um, we have to practice for the fall carnival, which is when. And what? What's the cow's name? Her name's Winnie the Moo. It's November 4th. The fall carnival is coming up November 4th, and it is uninhibited fun time. Uninhibited spooky fun time, if you will. Um, so Oliver is going to practice picking, picking names out of a cauldron today. And then we will do a fox training session. Um, and then, and then we will finish by handing out enrichment, maybe if we get to that at the end. Cool? Man, I really should have finished this before I start streaming. Big McLarge, huge. I can't. All right. So we're gonna start with mucking. Um, I will come back, and then finish that, and then rinse it out. This the smoothies give me anxiety because you have to rinse it out. Oh my god, maybe I should finish it. I don't know. Chug. I can't. So you can't chug it through a straw. How do you chug through a straw? Up? It's actually easier to drink. Like you just, you just throw it all. But it's viscous. Yeah. You now drink milkshakes fast? Mm mm. No. You chug milkshakes? I do everything fast. <laughs> <laughs> Did you fill up the whole thing? Yeah, pretty much. my site where we could get the tattoos. We're handing them out at TwitchCon Las Vegas. Mm -mm. I don't... Ain't no way you drank all of that. It literally shows it on the cup. What do you mean? This is the line where it filled up. Non-believers. Okay, I'm finishing this, then I'm gonna rinse it out, then I'm gonna go muck. I don't have a knife on me. Now I do. The knife is for utility, y'all, not for 
combat. What kind of smoothie is it? Oh, there's a lot of stuff in here. <laughs> Guys, look at my haunted rat maze. I made this smile. Right here, we have a haunted poo poo pee pee. This is a haunted graveyard. This is a haunted carnival. This is the void. This is a witch room. This is a haunted swamp. This is a dungeon. And this is a haunted house. It's for the fall carnival, which is November 4th. And the rats are going to navigate through this haunted maze with the help of chat. I don't know Not where out. they are. <laughs> I thought they'd be out. There are doors in each room and chat has to solve a riddle to go through each door. And then when you get into each room, you get a prize. Or the rats get a prize. That's what that is for. Huh? <laughs> Wonderful, excellent. <sighs> I'm so sorry, Connor. <laughs> You're fine. Oh, I'm sorry that you have to cameraman all the sucks. Fine. I can never. I chugged a Red Bull, so we're good. Connor chugged a Red Bull. Also, Connor insists on walking backwards because it's better for stream. Um, Flip walks behind me because Flip is really focused on like shots looking good and being cinematic. Granted, it's probably better for the cameraman to walk backwards, but Connor walking backwards all day is crazy. And uh, when we did the Fillion collab, he was running backwards in Crocs, and he almost died like three times. So we'll see today. What happens? And goat meal. You didn't do well blindfolded. Yeah. Guys, this is the devil spawn. Oatmeal. Catch me off guard. I didn't see her. <laughs> Gotta keep your head on a swivel chat. All right, time to scoop poop. Dude, leave me alone. Kylie, help. Ah! No, be dope. Ah, away. Right away. Thank you, Connor. Mm -hmm. Oh right. my god! What do you think of the new gate latch? I like it a lot. It's way better for stream. It is. Um. How do, oh god. I can't see. How do you? Glenn! Thank you! How do you turn up the brightness on a freaking Android? I did it. Um. The reptile room is the next project on the list. 90%. 10 minutes. Connor said it's 90%. It's not. Look, it's a chicken! Hello. Hi, Maya. Hi, 
Gotcha. Spence, thank you for the 39 months. Chicken? Do you guys think you'd be scared of Stompy in person? Yeah, a lot of yeses and a lot of noes. Not sure. I'm gonna be honest. There are some animals I don't really get. Stompy, like not having experience with ratites and walking up to this bird, I would be really scared. I feel like, like it's an intimidating animal. It's huge, and like it's got really scary eyes, and it wants to peck you, and that's a lot, you know. I, I would not judge you if you were afraid of Stompy. Yeah, it's a new necklace. He wants it. All right, where's the poop? No poop left behind. Chat, it's time to play I Spy Poop. I spy my little eye. Poo. Oh, dude, I'm using the new pitchfork today. Wow, Connor, that's a really crazy shot. You guys see all the poop flies. Wow, so cinematic. Oh my god. Um, no poop left behind. Connor, you're gonna run out of energy filming like that. <laughs> we'll be fine. <laughs> Beautiful. Um, thank you for the three months. Cross deck is a prime. Um, this is the new pitchfork, and it uh, has a bigger scoop, so you can collect more poop in one go. You know? Look at all that. Wow, amazing. Honestly, I actually don't like it as much as the other one. I think it's just because it's heavier. It doesn't feel as dynamic or something. I don't know. I don't know how to say that. How Hello, does, chicken. How does Flip make this camera not so freaking ex overexposed in the sunlight? Uh, he turns down the f-stop. That's what I, I did. I think, yeah. And the ISO. Yeah. But I don't know. It is an exceptionally bright day. Hi, guys and gals. Hey, guys. Hi. Thank you for the. Thank you for the two months. Dig. My foot is a poop scooper sometimes, and that's okay. Keep your mouth closed. All right, moving on. Oh my God. Whoop. Someone's gonna fall today. It might be me, it might be Connor, I'm not sure, but one of us is going to fall today. Look, it's a donkey! Chat. Over here, we have a donk. Oh. It's Serrano. That's all. Down here, we have a friend. A dung beetle. Oops, sorry. Here's a dung beetle friend. Oh, they're flighted, Connor, you can't try <laughs> Did you guys know dung beetles are flighted? I forget a lot, because they don't look like they would be. 
That's the first time I've picked one up and it's flown away. Lab on camera still alive or on? <laughs> you guys hear me breathing? That's so funny. That's so funny. Uh, I'm gonna bring this over here. Hi, chicken. Hello, little chicken. What are you doing? I thought it would be bigger. There are actually, I think there are close to 10,000 species of dung beetles. <laughs> Is that, am I wrong? Maybe it's 3,000. Wait, am I thinking of something else? There are 10,000 isopod species. Connor, oh my God. <laughs> I don't remember how many dung beetle species there are. I think there are 10,000. Someone look it up. I don't know. You're kneeling and shit. Okay. He feels fine about it. Oh my god. I hate mucking on rocks. Hello, chicken. La 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 la. It's actually hotter than I thought it would be today. It was pretty tasty. I thought it'd be cooler. I'm sad. Connor, oh my god. I'm telling you. You're great. You're gonna be sore because you keep squatting. You're doing like squats. I did this several times. I can do this. Okay. Oh. Hello, donk. I have to scoop the poop next to you. Excuse me, please don't be upset. No, it's a, don't be upset. You don't have to leave. And the rabbit is up for 30 months. Happy pop day. Thank you for the 30 months. Yeah, I actually don't like this pitchfork at all. It, be working pretty well. it doesn't, it feels harder to scoop things. Like it feels heavy. Piss me off. Mine needs more muscle? Yeah, I guess. I guess. La 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 la. Do da. Do da. La 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 la. Oh, there's a chicken. He is really cute. And he likes to bite. He's a chicken. Do do do. Ah, do do da day. It's hot enough for a stompy bath today. Look, it's a donkey! How often do you scoop the poop here? Every day. Every single day we get a full wheelbarrow's worth of poopy out of this pasture. No, you would see your footprint if you were. Hello, chicken. What do you think of this new poop scooper? Would you like to see it? I'll show you the handle. Your rating, sir? All right, whatever you make of that. approves.
tasty. Man, this is heavy. Oh, it rained last night. That's why. This is a heavy wheelbarrow, folks. We're not messing around. This is cow poop. You guys want to see a cool trick? Can you stay there? <laughs> oh my god. Tell me that wasn't sick. Half in, half out. Was it half, really? Yep. Damn. We got another one. We go again. <laughs> Damn it. Close. Close, but no cigar. Get in there. Did you all see that? It's okay if you didn't. It's better if you didn't. Word to the wise, only do that with cow shit. Do not do that with horse shit. If you do that with horse shit, you will get covered in horse shit. Definitely don't do it with goat shit because then it's gonna rain. <laughs> Chow, what do you think of Connor's cameramaning? How, how are you feeling so far? Is your immersion going crazy today? Oh my god. <laughs> Please. Ten out of ten. Okay. Alright. We go through the oak grove. Watch your head, watch your head. One time. A Sarah bolted and took us through some trees. I got fish hooked by a tree branch in the mouth. In the mouth? Yeah. Like a literal, like, fish hook. Right. Yeah, it cut my lip. Simran Phoenix was shot for 19 months. Yo. Yo. Thank you for the 19 months, Sim and Panzer. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Panzer. Um. All right, up we go. I, I think. Yeah. Oh. Oh, little da 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 da. Space. In the title, could you put uh? Emu bath before cowbell. <gasps> Chat, there's a butterfly. Connor's gonna National Geographic this shit. Check that out. That's a beautiful butterfly. What kind? I have no idea. There's a lot of butterflies. But. Can you see him? What's he doing in the poop? In the probably eating it. <laughs> Sorry. He's probably um, sucking poop juice out through his proboscis. Proboscis is like a butterfly straw that they always have on their face. <laughs> He's mad that I'm taking his poop buffet. He's flying around. Huh. Huh. Ow! Okay.
okay. Watch where you're going. Um, I need sunscreen. Actually. Race you to the top? No, I'm not gonna race you to the top. That's extremely unfair. I'm walking backwards. I'm pushing a fat wheelbarrow full of shit. Thank you for the sub. Chat, we have another candidate here. You guys ready? Action. <laughs> Never mind. I was gonna play a drum roll sound effect, but then I realized I'd get an ad and I'd have to be here for too long and it would ruin the moment. Damn it! Not enough arc. We go again. Damn it! I dropped it. Now it's in two parts, it won't work. Ew. Poopy pants, not everyone is like you. Connor's in the splash zone, that means y'all are too. <sighs> Two. Three. Yeah! It's good! Admit that was sick. <laughs> That's a three. That was awesome. <laughs> Up the hill we go. My favorite part of mucking is pushing the huge wheelbarrow full of shit up a hill. You guys want to know some lore? One time, I found a Sarah at the bottom of the pasture, and he was standing over one of these plants. This is a yucca plant. And one of these was up his shaft, and I thought that it was stuck in his shaft, his shaft being uh, his penile shaft. And so um, I freaked out and went and got hedge clippers. And then when I came back, he just moved, like he just walked away. And it turns out he was using it to scratch inside of his shaft. Um, but it still freaked me out, like he was not stuck, he was fine. He was just scratching. But then I went around and I cut the tops off of all of them anyway. There's some lore for you. There's a fucking rock there. Please. Stopping your momentum halfway up a hill is not a good idea. Ah! Okay. Goldmaster, thank you so much. Thank you for three months. Is this really a clip of him doing it? I'm showing you. Oh, it's so dark. I can't see that. Yeah. It's at night. Baby cow found food. On the Alveas channel. Uh, you can pay bits to feed the cow, but you have to do it really fast, otherwise the horse comes in and eats it instead. It's like a live narration, wasn't it?
on the Alvea Sanctuary Channel. Excuse me, folks. I'm just gonna grab this poop. Thank you. Chicken? shit this is a heavy wheelbarrow I hate it hello chicken What do you do with all that? We put it in a dumpster. Oh my God. In a dumpster. And the dumpster periodically gets taken off site. You may be thinking, why are you throwing away? Why don't you use it as fertilizer? Um, because we muck every day. Um, we're only on 15 acres here and we get a wheelbarrow this size every single day out of this pasture. And so if we spread it all around our property without other grazing animals to pack it down and um, just to like let it naturally decompose and become a fertilizer, our property would just be covered in shit. There is a saturation point with soils for how much nutrients they can handle um, and how much can be broken down. and. Uh, there would just be way too much. Stumpy, come here. No. Oh. Stumpy, chicken. Oh my God, what are you doing? You need to get out. It's a big cricket. You see him? I assume you can see him. It's a big cricket. So. They go. Zero. Thank you. Hi, buddy. You're kind of in the way. He's drinking Stompy's bath water. Stompy, you want to go swimming? A Sarah's kind of in your way. You kind of need that spot. go in your pool. You can do it. Pause champ. Oh. Oh. Pause, champ. He's so close. Uh oh. Well, that's six steps backwards. Now we're gonna be here a while. Stompy, you have to come out on the other side. Over here. Over there. No. Just cause you can just cause you're closer to the water doesn't mean you're in it. Go around. Okay, I right, come this way. Start over. Look. You can get in there. That would work. Or right here. Don't back me. Good try. Stoppy. That's not the way to go. Winnie, don't harass the bird right now. Okay.
Stompy. Don't peck me. Hooray, water. Hooray, so fun bath. I'm not really sure why. Okay. Well. Well, come here, Stompy. Come over here. Come over this way. Over here. Look. Follow the splashing. Okay, it's just way harder. Okay, crazy choice. All right, sure. Okay, wow. See, yeah, I don't, I'm not really sure why you... Are you okay? <laughs> All right, okay, cool. Are you happy? Now? <laughs> Yay, stop being in the bath. He's doing it. He's doing it. Mods, can you change the category? Big chicken. Yay, chicken. Yay, chicken. You said nice. Hello. He's swimming. Splash zone chat. Look out. Thank you for the 22 months. Cinematic. Splash out! Dinosaur. Please. <laughs> Please. Please. Thank you. Please! <laughs> Guys, there are about, what, 10,000 species of birds. Um, 
and they are descendants of dinosaurs. Um, dinosaurs were feathered, they've seen lots of evidence of that. Theropods were a two-legged, three-toed dinosaur with feathers. This is a two-legged, three-toed dinosaur with feathers. Their skeletal structure is like the same. It's crazy. Would Stompy be able to swim in a pool? What do you mean? He's doing it right now. If it was deeper, uh, yeah, yeah, he would. Why? Is there some advantage to them having feathers and not fur? Yeah, um, Stompy has really great insulation. Look at this. Come over here. Come over here. Oh, me. Look at this. Stompy is dry underneath. You see that? Okay, he's leaving, but you see that? It's an insulated bird right there. Oh my god, <laughs> he almost got you really bad there. Yep. Um, all right, this was requested. Except we kind of hate Jaws for what it did to sharks, but. <laughs> Fall Raven, Yoda, thank you guys for the subs. Hi, Winnie. People keep saying bigger pool, like, we didn't have to rent a fucking trailer to get this pool here. I don't think we can do any bigger in this pasture without putting, like, an in-ground pool in. Hi, baby cow. How are you?
What's the cow mask for? Uh, Winnie's wearing a fly mask. It's mesh, so you can, she can see through it. It's just to keep flies out of her eyes. She's watching the chicken swim. She's stylish. She has pretty eyes though, Sag. I know, it's to protect her pretty eyes. Are they friends? Um, <laughs> Stompy and Winnie? Their relationship is complicated. Sometimes they sleep next to each other, which is really cute, but then sometimes they push each other around. Stompy's been way better about Winnie. Stompy had a phase where she just went after Winnie constantly. Didn't actually hurt her, but was just like harassing her. She's way better about it now. Stompy doesn't seem like an emu that makes many friends. That's a really mean thing to say about Stompy. Stompy loves a Saro. That's nice. That is a big chicken. Oh. What? Alrighty, over it. This is a good place to get out. Come over here. Stompy. Stompy. Yeah, over here. Look. No, over here. Stompy, over here. Stompy. No, over here. Look. Stompy. Hey! Okay, wow! That was bizarre. Honestly, one of the cleaner exits that he's had. But I was not expecting him to do that. I don't know if I've ever seen him yump like that. Did I catch it on camera? Yeah, they saw it. it. They saw it. Oh. Alright! He's learning. That was clean. Good job, chicken. Is it nice? You feel better? It was glorious, they said. That was sick. <laughs> okay. Ah! One more poop. No poop left behind. One more poop on the way out. I really gotta pee. Speaking of poo-poo. Poo-poo pee-pee. All right. Should have played that for DMCA. Does Tommy get in the pool by himself? No, not really. He needs some like encouraging splashing to enter the pool. Stompy also has a splash pad and a car wash. I think Stompy really likes being in the pool, but he also really loves the splash pad. Like he might like the splash pad as much as the pool. Um. Okay. Excuse me. Excuse me, chat. Okay. Okay. All right, excellent. We're not racing. I will fall. And if I fall going downhill, pushing a wheelbarrow, I'm gonna fall forward into the wheelbarrow. You know what I mean? Like, that. I would personally rather not do that. Oh my God. Okay. Wait, do we need this here? Probably not. Okay, we're just gonna take it down. Thank you for the sub. Lost science girl, thank you for the sub. It looks clean already. Yeah, it's the chickens. 
I use the wheelbarrow with the, when I clean the chickens. But I don't know. Siren! I'm a dip da 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 Okay. Guys, we're going to dump this in the dumpster. And now we see if I can lift this wheelbarrow into a dumpster and dump it all out. Personally, I'm feeling really jacked today. So I think that it won't be a problem. But some days are better than others, you know? Some days I surprise myself with how frail I am. My shoulders hurt right now. This is all my shoulders, <laughs> the cramping, the cramping. How heavy do you think this is, Connor? 50, 50. This is... Well, it's wet, so I don't know. I don't think this is 50 pounds. I'll, I'll take 60 to 70. No, not 70. Maybe. All right. Here we are at the dumpster, everybody. What are you doing? <laughs> okay. In the shot, right? Interesting. I've never had a cameraman get in the dumpster. It's all about momentum, you know? hundred pounds of pure rock hard leverage. Oh my god. Holy shit, dude. We go. the ramp to dump the UTV. Huh? Do you use the ramp to dump the UTV? I don't think you really ever dump the UTV. I have used the ramp to dump the wheelbarrow, but it wasn't there today. I don't know where it is. <sighs> Pocket will do. Hi, sorry. I'm tired. I need sunscreen real bad. It's hot. I'm kind of pissed off. It's not supposed to be this hot anymore. So, the reason that mucking today was harder than it normally is is because it rained last night. So everything was heavier. I don't know why I'm tripping so much today. I need new boots, man. I know he sent me shoes. Those aren't boots though. I won't wear them as boots. I wear them as like hiking shoes. What? Yeah, they're gray. 
<laughs> it's also true. I need like boots. I need to get, I need to go buy boots. <sighs> oh shit. <laughs> Please. All right. Wear Crocs, dude. Crocs mucking and getting shit in the croc holes. Pass. Done it. Pass. Ew. All right. We're going to the studio. We're taking a water break, and I have to pee. And then we're gonna go down, and you guys will see Winnie's. Incredible recall with the cowbell. Cool. Stand by. Everybody. Stand by! I'll be back. Walking backwards is not the move. It's not the move. Going up that hill. But you know what? It's a good workout. It's a good workout. Chat, I miss my beard. Give it back, please. Oh, everything's so much colder. Um... Yeah, space. I have no clue how to tell what's in focus or what's overexposed when the sun is just beaming on that. Right just, yeah, you can't see shit. Yeah, uh, that's true. You kind of just guess. I didn't notice any issues, so. Cool. Did I get the stompy jumping out? I, I was busy, so I did not see that. Because I was like changing positions there. Anyway, how does it feel to be 20 year olds, 20 years old again? Good. I need another Red Bull. I just turned my shutter speed when that happens. Yeah, it's it's all automatic. So kind of changes. I can't leave it set. I do have a baby face. Stompy can fly. No, over here. Stompy, over here. Stompy. No, over here. Look. Oh, that looks good. Stompy. Sick. I wasn't even looking at the cam. What? If there's camera people in chat, what is the reason for keeping the shutter speed twice the FPS? Shutter speed twice the FPS. Why, why do we do that? Is it, does it ruin it if we do change the shutter Because right now it's always locked to the same shutter speed mostly. What? Shutter speed is a one out of a thousand. Like, yeah. Right it's chained, it's automatic. That's what it, normally it's, it's locked to double the FPS. Oh, gotcha. Um, and I don't know how bad, like, the exact reasoning. 180 rule. I don't know the exact reasoning, and like, what is the issue if you don't do that? Because that would help, it helps with the storage or something better. Well, I don't know what we're talking about. Has the cow been trained yet? No, that is next. Lindsay is cleaning um, the chins and the rats, or maybe just the chins right now. Um, and then, and then we can go down and do the cowbell. Winnie has been getting trained for recall. Um, so, like a dog whistle, but it's a cowbell for a cow. So we're doing that.
then after that is Oliver, right? After that is Oliver. Um, so we need to grab the, uh, yeah, Dumby. They don't really need to be trained for that. And then we gotta grab the cauldron and then I need to make slips of paper. What is it that Oliver's pulling? Can you see my monitor? Don't look here. It's fine, I can't see this one. Um, this one, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, fall carnival. Oliver, oh, Oliver's doing an evil wheel. So you know how streamers do wheel spins? And uh, it lands on something and then there's a consequence. Oliver's gonna do that but with picking something out of a cauldron for the fall carnival. And so we have to practice that today. And he also might pick bingo numbers, but I will use the scrap paper. Space, could I get the scissors? Could you throw me the scissors? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, let's cut slips of paper for Oliver. Started when we were younger, you were mine. and crafts. Yeah, something like that. Can we see Abbott do ring toss? Gotta size up the competition. Um, I, if we have time today, I, I, I did the ring toss with Abbott last week on keeping. Um, today we're keeping until 2.30. I had a film at 2.30 today. Use the scissors again. I can come in with the camera and get every single cut as you do it. That would go crazy. And would be super worth <laughs> taking the camera off the tripod. No, no. <laughs> um, but I will warn y'all, Abbott is going to ring to win the ring toss by a lot. He's really good at it, so. Yeah. Actual ceiling resubbed for twenty months. Actual ceiling? Thank you for the sub. Um, I don't know how long it's going to take Lindsay to clean the chins, so I wonder if we should do this now. Because then, yeah, maybe we should do this now. Let's go find the cauldron. Oh, sunscreen. Thank you. Let's put on sunscreen and then go find the cauldron. Sunscreen, sunscreen. La 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 la. La 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 la. You want to take a big, deep breath when you're doing that. I like the coconut smell. Yeah, it's really nice. Not the mic. Dude, how are they still on? These are the best temporary tattoos I've ever had. What the heck? That is crazy. <laughs> Put 
put those on yesterday. Connor, do you want sun sunscreen? Eh, all right. This hat's good enough. Okay, H. Thank you. I'm gonna put these back, hold on. Start a win, we were younger, you were mine. everyone. Good girl. Beetle, she wants the pieces of paper. No. <laughs> no. Not for you. Excuse me. Thank you. Excuse me. All right. Time to find the cauldron. No goats in the, no goats in the laundry room. All right, it would be in here. In the full carnival things. In the fall carnival things. Ah! The cauldron. It's actually like, it's really deep in there. I don't know if I should. I might have to put something under it so he can pick it from it easier. We'll see. We'll see. All right, time to get chicken treats. Go see chickens. Oh. Holy shit. <laughs> okay. Hello. Um, I'm gonna do some training with Oliver for the picking stuff out of here. Um, so whenever you're ready, you can. Yeah, I'm just waiting for that to dry. And cool. I'll come down once I get them put up. Okay. Wow, okay, he's in front of me. He's walking backwards. Everyone has really different music tastes at Elvis. Yeah, they do. Connor likes EDM hard style trap. I like country Noah Khan and sad. sad the alternative. Lindsay likes that, which I think is like I think that was from a musical, yeah. Kayla also likes stuff from musicals. I don't actually really know what Ella or Space listen to. Space doesn't really listen to music. Uh, Ella listens like old rock. Oh. He said Ella listens to old rock. Classic rock. Though. Classic rock. Not run into me. Caleb likes metal. I also like pop smoke. I haven't listened to pop smoke in a while though. Um, okay, so if any of you are wondering why do I have a cauldron, it's because, um, hi Siren, it's because we have a fall carnival coming up November 4th. And Oliver is gonna have his very own set 
and he's going to pick names out of this cauldron, or he's gonna pick consequences out of this cauldron for chat. So we have to practice. This is Oliver. Are you ready? Oliver, you come here. Can you, do you see this is a cauldron? This is for you. Nugget, would you like to pick? You could pick if you want. Oliver! I should have brought a target down here. Nugget, you want to pick? I mean, at least you throw, if you throw um, insects in there. Might go in there. Well, I'm concerned because there's a bunch of mealworms up there and he's not interested. Oh. So, which I've never seen, so he might just not be very motivated. Can you pick? He's not interested. Do you want this? Interesting. Interesting. Oliver. My friend, come here. For you. For you. For you. That's actually crazy. I know. For you. Can you pick? Good job! Good job! He did it! He remembers! He's amazing! Chat. He picked this. Excellent. Good job, buddy. Okay, Nugget, can you move? Oliver, can you pick? Can you pick? Yes, good job. He doesn't really like these. Are these not mealworms? Is this black soldier fly? Maybe he doesn't like it as much. No, good job! <laughs> good job! Good job! Yeah, he just doesn't like these. Sorry, bud. Yeah. Do you want to keep picking? Can you pick? Oh. Can you pick? Oh. It's, is it too far down? Can you pick? Good job! Good job! Yeah, he hates these. I'm sorry, dude. Can you pick? Good. Good job. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'll bring you mealworms next time. Mealworms next time for Oliver. When did he become such a spoiled man? He used to like all bugs. <laughs> so if I pick, I get these bad worms. I'm sorry! <laughs> Siren, you wanna maybe... You wanna maybe... Siren! Oliver, you want to pick? He's like, why the hell would I? <laughs> and for what reason? Mia. Mia. Do you guys want to go see Siren? Do you want to pick? <laughs> yeah. All right, well, mealworms next time. I mean, for training wise. Easy. Yeah, he definitely remembers how to do that. I wasn't worried about it at all. Oliver's good at picking things. All right. It wasn't even a good, I mean, he, he did it like successfully a bunch of times. I just didn't have anything to reward him with. Hey, Siren. Let me reward you for your screaming by coming and saying hi to you and giving you attention.
I guess we can tell if the AC is working. Yeah. Uh-huh. Hello, Bernie. Hello, Bernie. Hello, Bernie. Hello. Mm. Siren? Hello. Mia? Hello. How are you? Siren? How, oh, don't go down there. Stay up here. That's fine. Siren, can you sing? Can you sing? Can you sing birthday? Birthday. 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 Hello, birdie. Okay. She does not want to sing happy birthday. There we go. That's the little yin. Birthday. 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 Nothing. Maybe we play her sea shanty. You want to play? You want to sing? You want to do your birthday shanty? shanty? Birthday. Can you put her over there? I mean, Siren's like really not about her right now. She's all the way over there, so you're fine. Oh, the remix. That's nice whistling. Okay, now Siren has had her singing time, Mia will have her dancing time. Mia? What do you think? Siren! Guys, what do you think about her dancing? Siren right now. That's good, Mia. Good job. <laughs> Mia, Thanks. you almost had your moment. Okay, I'm really sorry that Siren ruined it for you. Okay, pet. Yes, happy birthday, Siren. We get it. We've we've heard you sing already today. Everything <laughs> 
want one of these in my house. And to do this when I'm on a business call. <laughs> Yeah, guys, you don't want parrots, okay? Just you want you want a, a dog or a cat is what you want. What does the decibel meter say? Kind of hard to see. Yeah, it said forty. I mean, this is not when she's screaming. The. The macaws have maxed it out at 130. Huh. You're a pretty boy. Okay. Wow. Excellent. Thank you so much. I want 10 of them. No, you do not. No, you do not. You know, the other thing about parrots is this. Mia did this. Smile. She made this smile. Um, she fly, flew over here and birds chew through wood. So she did this just for funsies, for no reason, just for fun. Um, so this could be your door frame or your window frame or your uh, kitchen cabinet or your dresser or your nightstand. Siren? Yeah, and that's a little one doing it. The macaws do that. See that platform up there? It was a four foot by four foot. No, not four. Two. It was a two by two foot platform. And now it's but a small island. I don't even know what she's talking about anymore. Okay, that's fine. You can talk like that. That's fine. What? What do you think? Okay. Can I pet you? <laughs> no. She said no and laughed at me. This is so funny. Hey, pet. Hey, pet. No. She said, don't touch me. And then we have the macaws. Siren, I'm just going to show them the macaws. No, I just want to show them the macaws. These are the macaws. Uh, this is Tico and Miley. Miley's the one on the right. Tico's the one on the left. Tico's the blue one. Um, that looks a little more not happy that I'm here. Uh, Tico's a blue and gold macaw, or a blue and yellow macaw, because she's blue and yellow. Um, and Miley is a Catalina macaw. It's a hybrid between a blue and yellow and a scarlet macaw, which is your classic, uh, like, red parrot that you see on pirate's shoulders. However, Siren! How However, I told my stream the other day, it's funny, people think of parrots and pirates together. Um, because it's like a, a thing, it's like there's a, a parrot on a pirate's shoulder. Turns out, uh, pirates were smuggling parrots, um, from the New World to sell as pets in Europe. So they were capturing them out of the wild and then smuggling them and trafficking them. So that's why people associate pirates with parrots. Not because they're friends. It's possible that they kept some of them as their own pets. Um, but... Yeah, sad. Mia's actually a really good dancer. Um, do you want to show them? You want to switch? Show the dancing? Yeah. We might be able to get her to do it with me holding it. Yeah, I was going to just take the camera. Okay, let me try it. Chat, Connor's going to see if he can get Mia to dance because she won't dance with me. Mia likes men. Sweaty backpack. Yay. Mia! Uh, Do you want me to play? Okay. Um, He's playing a song. Uh, Don't say that's bass. That's not bass. Uh, what do the animals think of no beard? Uh, has anyone noticed? No, right? Um, not really. I need to put it on the branch. Siren, don't get mad. 
Hello, Birdie. <laughs> That's nice. <laughs> Siren, chill. Siren's throwing her off. Come on. <laughs> Here, Get her away from Siren. Siren, no! Come on. Siren's ruining it. <laughs> Good job. Good job. One more. Come on. <laughs> Making me look stupid. <laughs> That's what parrots do. <laughs> Nice. That was really good. What do you guys think of Mia's dancing? Man, that camera's heavy. Mm -hmm. I could not do that. <laughs> Mia, can I pet you? Can I pet? I pet. Thank you. We're leaving. Oh, I need my hat. Oh. Hello, Lindsay. Hello. I'm ready to get out of this aviary. Because sirens make me lose my mind. Treats. This is Lindsay. Lindsay, this is Chat. Gobius, thank you. Hello, little goats. Goodbye. Goodbye, Siren. So much today, dude. Ooh. Nice beetle. Ooh, fun. I hope he knew how to little red mark on his forehead. Oh. I wanted to double check. Ouch. No goats in the pasture. No. no. All right, guys. Um, Lindsay is going to help show you guys Winnie's recall today. We're going to check out Jalpeno's notes because he's got a little scratchy on his notes. <laughs> She's so cute. That was Connor, by the way. Connor actually has a pretty good cow impression. And goat. And goat. Wait, there's another die on? Molly. What the heck? There's a baby cow. There she is. Oh. Okay, you're yeah, gonna get the horse over here. Mm. Come here, Win. Come on. No. Well, here comes a Sarah. Winnie. Connor, do you have any more cows on the list? No, but I can. Okay. Look, guys, it's Winnie the Moo. Sorry. It's Winnie the Moo. This is a baby cow. I'm gonna take her fly mask off so you guys can see her better while we're doing this. Thank you. So nice. 
Um, Winnie is one and a half, gonna be two years old in March. Um, she's a Renangus beef cow. We got her from beef operation in Oklahoma. Um, so she was on her way to being slaughtered for beef, but now she lives here. Um, recommendation for all of you guys from What the heck? Why is she doing that? Uh, she wants the black soldier fly. Both, both from an animal welfare perspective and from an environmental perspective. Uh, one thing you can, what a weirdo. Uh, one thing you can do for the environment is to eat less beef. The emissions that come out of the beef industry are pretty wild. Uh, cows produce methane, which is a greenhouse gas, and we have a bunch of cows. Um, and so they produce a bunch of methane, and then also there's a lot of deforestation that happens to clear um, land for cattle ranching. Okay. A lot of that uh, is done in the Amazon too, where there's a ton of biodiversity. Um, so yeah, eat less beef is better for the environment and better for cows. Huh. She's really excited. She's ready. Take a handful with me. How do you want to do So you're going to halter her and then walk her away? Yeah, and then, and then you're going to ring the bell, and then as soon as she gets to you, put the... Put the bucket down. down. All right. That was a cough, yeah. She knows the blue bucket. How many are you going to do? Just one. One, because I'm going to yeah. take her, like, way far away. Okay. Halter? <laughs> you got to let me put it on you. <laughs> Good. Does Winnie ever moo? Yes, she does. Why did you spit it out? Winnie the moo does moo. What are we learning right now? Um, I just did a little, a little spiel, spiel, spiel. Is that a real word? Um. Spiel. I just did a little spiel on why eating less beef is better for the environment and better for cows. Um, so if you can reduce your consumption of animal products, with beef in particular. Oh yeah, if you could wear that, that'd be great. Okay. Um, be a walk the whole time. Uh, it's a magnet one, so you could just magnet piece. Wait, what? How do I do this? Like, Help. Like this. Sorry. I don't know how this works. Okay. Um, Welcome. You're gonna hear go, me talk all the time. Go. Walk. So I did a little spiel on why eating beef 20. is better Walk. for eating less beef is better for the environment and Walk. better for cows. Um, and now we're gonna watch a little Winnie training session. Walk. Um, Winnie Good. has learned how to get her halter put on and how to walk on a lead. Stuff like this is important for our pasture animals. I'll let you chew. Um, Walk. So that we can do. Walk. Husbandry, um, veterinary procedures, Walk. taking them other places. Uh, without having to force them into things. Um, walk. So we do lots Good. of a lot, lots of training. You gotta come to me. Behaviors like voluntary injections. That was gross. Putting a halter on. Um, being okay walk. with us touching and picking up their feet. Voluntary walk. nail trims. Stuff like that. Winnie. Walk. And so for Winnie, <laughs> she is Pressure. one step at a time, literally. Good. Learning how to walk on lead. It's in my pocket, hold on. Lindsay's gonna walk her all the way down. Um, hey, go. Down into the pasture, and then okay. we're gonna show you guys her recall. Recall is also walk. important in case Winnie. we have to get Winnie back somewhere. If there's something she's walking towards, we don't want her to go that way, or if she gets food. out, and we have to get her to come back. Um, walk. Same way, recall is important for your dog, where you whistle and walk. your dog comes back, or your dog knows their name, I know and you that's know. important for the safety of your dog. Uh, we have that for Winnie, except her that is poop. Her recall is a cowbell instead Don't of a sassy. dog whistle. Because you Walk. can make a recall whatever you want. We thought it was funny. Sassy cow. So. I need to get to the her tree. Recall is a cowbell. Walk. More than one step, please. Walk. That was one step. Walk. She's doing great. She's doing good. Great. All right, I'm gonna take her halter off and then I'm gonna have you ring the bell. 
I'm sorry, I don't have any more. That's all I got. Here's the bell. All right, you ready, chat? All right, it's off. It's ready. She's responding much better now. Yeah, that was awesome. She's super enthusiastic. She's so fast. She knows it's coming. So I need to like start walking her. Yeah. More. It's like you're gonna take the halter off. She's gonna <laughs> yeah. flip around. Watch Stompy for your ears. Thank you. Oh, well, cow Sassy. recall everybody. Thank you, Lindsay. Yeah. Amazing. She's amazing. Like a lure for falconry. Yes, like a lure for falconry. Stompy, I feel like you're being a lot today and it's stressing me out a little bit. This is Stompy every day. Sermano, can I look at your feet? Winnie eats cubes. Do you want one? Good. Giant cow-sized grain pellets. Can I touch? <laughs> I want to show comparison. Good. What? It's not that large. Okay, <laughs> it looks the same size. Serrano, touch. <laughs> Good. I know, that's your bed, like, I'm sorry. Yum, cube. Can you have a fly that's not a cube. in your You're face? right, it's not. I don't, well, I don't know why we call them cubes. Hi, horsey. Here you go. This is a horse. I'm going to go look he at just lives your here. brother. We watched Spirit last night. No, it's not for you. Um. Oh, Lindsay still has the mic on. Do you want some treats? Oops. I just want to look at your face. We watched Spirit. The movie Spirit is you based on um, Kiger Mustangs. Good boy. And Sarah was a Kiger Mustang. He's stop. also annoying. Good. Is that you got him? No, that's not why I got him. Touch. I didn't know that until like years into me having Good. him. Yeah, Touch. Really cool to I know. I'm I so can't believe Matt funny. Damon voiced Spirit. Did you guys know that? It's so I funny. Know. Touch. Good. He's starving. Might just be a superficial wound, but I want to double check for you, sir. He's not starving. You're stressing There's me out. There's literally a whole bag of hay right there. He just wants what the cow Good. has. He did what? You. Matt Thank Damon. You for letting me look. Is the Touch. <laughs> inner boy. conscience voice narration I spirit. Continue to eat. Stop! Pissing me off. Look, you want a treat? This is for you. Come here. 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 Jalapeno's face is just superficial. Oh, we, like, good. scraped it. Come, a Sarah? It's Do not. you want this treat or not? I will give it to what? you, but only over here. Look. A, Look at it. Underneath there. Gonna... Come here. Oh. Wow, amazing. You're a genius. Stay over here. Thank you so much. Good. I'm glad it's not anything secret. Has she ever rode a Sarah on stream? Yeah. Uh, I have. I can jump on him after when he eats, but I'm not going to do it while she's eating because then I would ride him into battle and the battle would be with the cow and then I would feel bad. Halt. Sure, go to that feeder. Go over there. Are you done, Winnie? No, I don't think so. I know. Alrighty. I'm gonna put her fly mask back on. Yeah. Since they're really bad. Yeah, they're really bad today. Acero? Don't. No. Don't put your ears back and look at her butt. Like you're gonna uh, bite her you butt. Do you wanna sell it? Shh, no. I can do it later. I can, I can block him. 
We're used to getting blocked, aren't we, sir? Yes. Beep, beep. There's nothing in it. I gave it all away. Sorry, not sorry. I got some eye boogies going on. You got some eye boogies and you're a little swollen. <laughs> Sorry, sir, it's empty. But you get all of the grain, so you're fine. All right, guys. They're yumping. They're yumping. Okay. Thank you, Lindsay. Yep. We'll go up. Let's go. Chatters. Okay. Um, yeah, whenever you're done in here, pretty much. Um, Sounds good. Chat, look behind you. That's a donk. That's a donk. Oh my god. The donkey was like, why is why is he running? Bye buddy. That's Serrano. He's a nice little man. That thinks he's a teenager. So, actually, see the like whole horse ear thing. What does teenager mean? Because when they said teenager, when I think of a teenage horse, I think like 10, 11. But that's actually closer to half their, well, I mean, they'll live to be like 30. So, in people years, a teenager for a horse would be like, less than that, right? Because 15 is like 50 for them. I don't know, I'm confused. Thank you. Oh God, here comes my favorite goat. Goat meal. <laughs> it's crazy that's their recall i connor does recall for all the goats honestly if i made that noise they probably would come i don't do the meh thing very often though i just call beetle <laughs> I love Beetle. Maybe we should give Beetle some Gatorade. Maybe we should give all the goats some Gatorade. Has Pee-wee had Gatorade? I don't know. Have Pee-wee and Tripper had Gatorade? Do you guys remember? Not on stream? I've never given it to him off stream. I feel like it's gonna be hard to try to give Tripper or Pee-wee anything because the other goats will bully them. Like frozen Gatorade? No, like Gatorade, Gatorade. We have Gatorade powder. Um, for livestock, goats, horses, I don't know about cows. I didn't grow up with cows, but for goats and horses, uh, in the summers, or if you're doing like a long haul transport, a little bit of Gatorade is good because of the electrolytes, if they're not drinking as much water. So it's like a, it's a treat for them. We've given it to the donkeys, Acero, and the goats because they love it. I don't think that our baby goats, the brown and white ones that you saw out there have had Gatorade yet. So we're gonna do a taste test. It's gonna change their lives. But somehow I have to knock at the attention of the other goats, the older ones, because they'll beat them up. If you drop some grain, they'll get they'll pushed off. They'll get pushed off the grain and then... Or you can pick up two goats and put them on the treehouse. Or 
I could act like I don't have anything and then sneak around the adult goats and then go to Pee Wee and Tripper with this not sus thing that I'm holding. Hello, goat. This has nothing to do with you. Is ready. Peewee's ready. Hello, goats. I'm just walking away with something that doesn't concern any of you. Hello, Peewee. Maybe you should come with me. Come here, buddy. Why are all the goats coming with me? Okay, this isn't gonna work. It's not gonna work. Peewee, I, you have to go in the treehouse. What is it? Where are you going? <gasps> no, beetle! Don't eat that napkin. She broke my, she ruined my cover. She started eating the napkin. Connor's gonna pick Pee-wee up, I think. There he is. Pee-wee, treehouse time. Let me put Tripper up there. Or do you just want one at a time? Um, just Pee-wee's fine for now. Pee-wee, here is Gatorade. Look for you. No, in here. No, no, no. In the container. <laughs> He's confused. Pee-wee, <laughs> Pee-wee. <laughs> Drink peewee. Peewee, look. Drink in th this. Peewee. Pee he doesn't get it. Peewee likes all fruits and vegetables. So like if you give him a treat, he likes it. He just doesn't understand this concept of like, drink this. Peewee. Peewee. Look. You smell it? He's crying. Thank you. Pee Wee, do you want a treat? You can have a treat. You know about these. It's a wafer. Look what you got. <laughs> King of the castle. <laughs> Beetle, please. You are the King Beetle, of please. The <laughs> I know you know what I have. All right, chat. You guys want to see how much Beetle likes Gatorade? Beetle for you. You want a crunch? A wafer? You know, there's nothing more in there. Okay, give it up. Look. Beetle. <laughs> this is so much. Crunches. That's how you chug. Hey, Pee Wee, sorry, buddy. I'm a tripper. Hi, Trip. All right, well, Pee Wee doesn't understand the concept of Gatorade. Maybe someday he will. Pee Wee's slow. Pee Wee's a little slow. It's okay. Beetle, I have nothing more for you. You gotta relax. They're all gone. That's it. Kylie also likes Gatorade. Do oh, not no. push him down. Do not be mean to the little man. Oh, you bitch. Ready? I saved him just in time. She was gonna throw him off. Exactly what was gonna happen. I know. <laughs> All right. Hello, Kylie. Sorry. Do you want what's in here? Kylie, you want what's in here? It's not much. Just licks. Gatorade powder. Delicious. 
delicious. All right, well, that was unsuccessful. I'm scared. I'm scared. What about Tripper? Would you drink Gatorade if I put it in here? I don't know. I don't know how to set it up. Tripper's way more picky than Pee Wee is, though. Pee Wee will eat anything, Tripper will not. So I feel like if Pee Wee didn't drink Gatorade, Tripper won't drink Gatorade. Connor just built this goat treehouse, by the way. What do you think? He did this during the subathon. I think it's pretty good. Akitsu said, What color is a giraffe's tongue? It's like dark blue, I think. Brian, thank you for the prime. Timbo, thank you for the 34 months. Cameron, thank you. Brandon Moore, Lost Airbender, Lucifo, Gobius, Mark. Sorry guys, my alerts got muted. I'm not sure why I pocket muted my alerts. Do they use it without us being there? Yeah, she's damaging the infrastructure. Yeah, I'm talking about you. I saw you doing that. Don't do it again. There's no more in here. You can't go in there. Okay. Oh, uh, the rats. Where are the rats? Where are the little friends? Radar, thank you so much for the prime. Oh, thank you. That will work. They're somewhere around here. Chat, time to play I Spy. Thank you for the yeah, sub. Them, Good job, chat. <laughs> <It's all because Connor. laughs> <laughs> People claps for yourselves. Are they wrestling? <laughs> What are they doing? Favorite little rats? Hey little rats? Hey little rat? Who wants to come over here? Oh, there's chips. Did you come yeah. here? Go get some. Hello. <laughs> you come here. Over here. Oh, you can do it. <laughs> chips. Chips. Over. Chips. Ch oh. Chips. Chips. No chips. Ch okay. Sure. Here's Chips Ahoy. This is Chips Ahoy. You wanna see chat? Oh. And this is Nilla Wafer. Chips. Nilla Wafer. Chips, would you like to go check out the rat maze by chance? Here you go. Chips, over here. Over here. 
delicious. Dried peas. All right, let's see. Let's see. I don't know if they'll come all the way. They will. Chips. They're munching, they're snacking. You guys want to come further? Over here? To the rat maze? Come on, chips! Rat maze time! <laughs> okay, so I made this rat maze for the fall carnival. And it's gonna be actually put together right now. It's just sitting on the floor. But there are little doors. So you guys will help the rats go through the doors. <laughs> like so. Can you go through the door? Yeah, go, you guys, good job, amazing. She's amazing, she's amazing. And then chips. Chips. Uh oh. We lost her. Chips. Come here. <laughs> Come on. We got a little rat. One. Can you go through the door? I got it, I got it. Over here, over here, over here, over here. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I just have to, I need more hands. You gonna go through this door? Wow, she's amazing. She's amazing. Come here, chips. She knows I have food in that hand. I need a third hand. Nilla's here to my left. Nilla. Yes, good job, Chips. You're doing great. Would you like to, oh, checking out chat. Chips, would you like to go through another door? Where'd she go? <laughs> She's gone. Behind you. Little rat. Where's Nilla? I see chips. <laughs> it's hard to tell where you never know. Oh, the chips is right behind her. Chips? Nilla? Uh oh, uh -huh. what'd you find? Did you find some garbage? Uh -uh. <laughs> Trash rats. Uh. There's Nilla. Okay, there she goes. <laughs> they found a lot. Yeah. Oh. Peach! Is that for D&D? <laughs> it's uh, for our fall carnival. It's a haunted rat maze. Look, I'll give you a tour. I made this smile. This is a haunted house. Thank you for gifting. This is a dungeon. This is a spooky swamp. And this is a witch room. And then the other side, there's a void and a carnival and a cemetery and a haunted poo poo pee pee. 
and the rats have to go through all these doors and chat is going to help them unlock these doors and then chat gets a prize in every room that they unlock. That's the plan. <laughs> haunted poop of BB. It's a haunted poop of BB. But yeah, that's going to be on November 4th. It's a fundraiser at Elvis. Can I get another rat friend by chance? Chips, are you interested in participating again? Chips. Thank you. Oh my god, saved. Chips! Here she comes! Come on! It's time to practice. Oh. Chips! <laughs> it's time to practice for the carnival. Here she comes. Yes. Can you come over here? Can you come through the door? Oh, no, 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 no. She found the jackpot. You want to go through this door? She's a genius. Okay. You want to go through this door? Oh my god. Please, chips. Please, chips. Over, chips. Okay. Yes. Oh my god, amazing. She's amazing. Okay, what about through this one? Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> She's a genius. She's a genius and she can't be stopped. <gasps> Nilla. Here's Nilla, everybody. <gasps> wow, good job. Chips, don't seal. Sealing's wrong. Chips. They're too fast, they do too much. <laughs> Look, a door. Look. Nope. <laughs> Good job! Come here, chips. Don't bite my hand. Yes, good job. Hi, Nella. Oh, wow. You're so brave. Berman 29 subbed for the first time. Chips, can you show them? Does Chips spin? Uh, they're learning how to be spinning. Can you spin? Wow. Lily 157 resubbed for 15 months. Give me Chips. Thank you for the 15 months. Chips! Come here! Can you spin? Wow! Can you stay here? Okay. <laughs> Can you come over here? Look. Can you spin? Can you... Oh, 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 oh. Can you spin? Wow. Okay, Chips. Too much. Chips. Too much. Chips. Chips! Come here. Can you talk? Oh, 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 can you, can you, can you talk? Oh my god, good job. <laughs> I'm exhausted, come here. Um, rats are really smart and like really fun to train. Can you, can you, can you spin? They're very smart, they're very fun to train. One of the reasons that we have rats is to teach people, can you spin? Teach people about rodenticide use. People will use rat poison um, to kill rats. She just keeps going around. Yes. Um, people use rat poison to kill rats, uh, but then the rat will die and then like an owl will eat that rat. And then the owl dies. It's something called biomagnification. It happens with pesticide use too. You'll put pesticides on a plant, kill a snail, and then a lizard will eat that snail. Can you tell? And then the snail will get sick as well. Um, or I'm sorry, the lizard will get sick as well. And so we always, can you spin? Wow. Advocate for um, natural pesticide use. Spin. So you can do things like eggshells. There's peppers that you can use um, instead of chemical pesticides. Can you spin? Wow. And then with rats, there are lots of other ways to um, Wow, so tall. 
to mitigate rat problems that you may have that don't involve poisoning rats. Um, there are CO2 traps, can you tell? But then there's also just like getting rid of, of rodent habitat around your house. If you have open food, rats are gonna come in your house because they're opportunistic, can you tell? Good job. So just know if you're putting out rat poison or you're putting out pesticides that are chemicals, you're affecting a lot more at all than what you want to be affecting. It's definitely more than rats and it's definitely more than snails. Uh, those kinds of things never go away. Come here. Can you spin? Wow. You wanna go through the door? Okay, stay there. No, oh. Come here. Go through. Oh, oh. Yes, good job. She's gone. It's like impossible. So I, I don't do a lot of training on keeping streams. It's like impossible to talk and train at the same time. I cannot have a full thought when I'm doing all that. It stresses me out. Sorry. Oh, I tried. Yeah, rodenticides can also definitely harm outdoor cats. Oh my God, she's back. <laughs> Here you go. Here you go. That's nice. Here you go. What's a better way to get rid of rats? So, like I just said, um, reducing rodent habitat around your house, number one. So you wanna prevent them in the first place. Um, if you already have them, don't use glue traps and don't use rodenticides. Uh, and then do your research on um, what other traps you can use that are safer and better for the environment. Can you, oh, can you? So there's CO2 traps that are fine. Can you scoop? Okay, interesting. It's a, it's a, yeah. Uh, and then there's electric traps too. Um, come here. Key scoop. Wow. Good old manual snap traps are good too. Good old what? Good old manual snap traps. Manual snap traps. Key scoop. Do not use cats. Outdoor cats are not the way. Key scoop. Um, outdoor cats harm a lot more than just rats. Uh, outdoor cats kill a lot of birds. The treats are in between my legs, so she can't get them. That's what's happening. Come here. Come here. Key scoop. <laughs> a scoop of chips. Come here. Key scoop. Good job. I want to see Moo get trained. You'd miss the cow getting trained. Sorry, spooked her. Uh, we did the cow training. Next, we're going to do the fox training. Um, and guides tomorrow. Oh, nice. It's nice of you. We can go see the crows if you want while we're waiting. The rats? Yeah. Little rats? Uh, do you wanna have enrichment for Oh, yeah. Thank you. Where is. Thank you. Did I just put their treats? Oh, thank you so much for weighing yourself. That was amazing. Chat, guess how much the rat weighs? Chips. In grams. Come here. Can I get a weight, please? Good job. 
330 grams. Wow, so big. Thank you. Where's Noah? Noah has not been out here very much. I don't know if I'm going to get a weight on her. Oh, well. She's in the laundry. Nilla? Can you come out of the laundry and can I weigh you, please? Ma'am? 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 What are you doing? Please. I'm going to get you. <laughs> oh, she loved it. No, stay there. No, Nilla. Yeah. Can you come here? I need you on the scale. Over here. Over here. Over here. Yes. 280? 280 and 330. That's good. There you go. Uh, they're both female. All right, let's get the rats back inside. Do you create them to put them up or do you think they'll go up? They'll go up on their own. Kind of like tell them to go over there. Chips? Key scoop. Thank you. Hank is not out anymore, but he did eat his entire zucchini, and we got literally all day yesterday. Incredible. Nella. Nella. Ma'am. Ma'am. What you doing? Time to go home. I see you, little rodent. Little rat. There she is. Here she comes. Well, well. <laughs> Good job. Oh, here you go. <laughs> All right. Rats are up. Amazing. This is rat enrichment. There's treats in here uh, and tissue paper. It's a little cardboard thing that they have to chew through to get to the treats. They have all three stories of this cage. Okay, um, would you guys like to see the crows? by chance. Just want to see what you're up against. Oh, is this for tomorrow? Yeah. yeah. You can take it. No, it's fine. It will do from here. Okay. Or from here. Excellent. All right, let's go see the crows and then we will go to the foxes. Road Bear 90 resubbed for 16 months. 
Rob Air, thank you so much. I'll be there momentarily. Okay. Crow time. Crow time, crow time. Dee 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 dee. Um, we'll go do a little crow training sesh here so you guys can see what you're up against for the fall carnival. One of the fall carnival games is the haunted rat maze. We also have a grain eating contest versus Winnie the cow um, where she eats grain and we eat dry Cheerios. We have a ring toss versus Abbott. I'll show you how Abbott stacks rings and then you guys will have to virtually stack rings against him. We have bingo with either one of our marmosets or um, our chicken. So you guys will have an extension where you all have bingo boards. So you can get points that way. Um, yeah, this gate's a bitch. Um, and then What else am I missing? I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember. I already said grain eating. Well, anyway. Um, anyway. Uh, there will be a bunch of events with the animals that are interactive with chat. So you guys can uh, you guys can play games at the carnival. And then I'm making tickets too. Um, I'm gonna sign tickets. Uh, it's like a postcard. But I've designed a bunch of tickets. Potion slurping is that's so real, actually. That's funny. Um, honestly, that's really funny. Hi, Abbott. I'll think about it. Oh, that was fifty dollars! Holy shit! Thank you for the fifty dollars. I'm sorry. I just heard the the dono message. Thank you for the fifty dollars. That's a donation to Alveus. Thank you so much. Hi, buddy. So I'm making tickets that I'm going to sign and ship out uh, so you guys can make a donation and we'll ship you a ticket. Um, and then also we're going to do signed Polaroids uh, for the fall carnival as well. Um, so if you make a certain amount of donation, then we'll send you a signed Polaroid. So I'm going to show you guys how Abbott does his rings. This is Abbott's ring toss. You guys will have to... Stack rings versus Abbott, and whoever wins, wins. <laughs> Here we go, buddy. One. Scary cameraman, new cameraman. Can you get closer? One. 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 He's really scared of calm. One. 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 It's okay. It's okay. He's all the way over there. One. Good. One. How do we stack the rings? Uh, uh, oh, good job. Uh, Thank you. One. Good. Good job. One. Good. Two.
on there. <laughs> Where are you going? Oh, neither of these are on. No. No. <laughs> Four. He's usually much better at this. So you can see this stacking better, maybe. Uh, 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 Two. Uh, 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 Good. Uh, 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 Good job. Uh, uh, Three. Uh, 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 Good. Uh, 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 Good job. Uh, 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 Wowee. Alright. Four. Good. When he gets it, dude, you guys are done for. Yeah, he's actually sandbagging. Five. What's sandbagging? Hold. Isn't that where you act like you're bad? But you're not bad? I, thought, I don't know. Is that smurfing? Or is it the same thing? I've just never heard of I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm... I read it in chat. One. Yeah. yeah. Good. Good job. Um, somebody asked, sorry, somebody asked how you guys are going to stack rings. Good job, buddy. Good. Uh, and I didn't answer because I was training um we're gonna have an, an animation of a ring moving back and forth and you guys are gonna have a poll to decide which quadrant it stops in uh, and then a ring is gonna get thrown and if you click if you choose the right quadrant the same one that the ring gets thrown in then you get a ring uh and if you pick the wrong one then you miss that's how it works Good job. Yeah, that was great. Yeah, yeah. Killed it. All right. Chat, this is an actual test run. Imagine you were ring tossing against Abbott right now. Five. Good. Good job. Oh. Whoa. Good. <laughs> Good job. Yes. Good. Okay. Good. Killing it. Excellent. All right. Four there. Ready? Five. He stacks the ring and he thinks he completes to make us a vocalization. But when he doesn't think he's complete, he doesn't vocalize. Really? He works it out, yeah. I haven't noticed that. Connor just said when he stacks it and he thinks he did it, he vocalizes. And if he doesn't think he did it, he won't. So we're going to test that. Three. Five.
None of these are on. Good. Yeah, I don't think that holds up. Or it didn't. He's just constantly vocalizing to me. He just vocalizes every time he moves. <laughs> every time he moves. Honeybee, thank you for the five months. One. Good. <laughs> One. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Good. And do two. Good job. Uh, uh, Two. Whoa, those are far. Uh, Good running. Uh, Good. Yeah. Uh, Good. <laughs> uh, wow. Good job, buddy. Oh, yeah. Put it. Yeah. Get it on there. Good job. Uh, 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 really. Get that one on. Yeah. Good job. <laughs> All right. It's pretty nice. Pretty nice, buddy. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. I love his run. Wait, test? I just want to know what would happen. One. <laughs> Where'd it go? One. Do you see it? One. One. It's over there. Look, I show you. Here it is. Can you get it out of there? He's like, what the heck? One. Good. Okay, Abbott, Abbott, leave that one. One. Oh, too close to the cameraman, maybe. Good job. Uh, Hi, coconut. Uh, Good. Uh, uh, one. No, 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 no. Uh, <laughs> He's like, here's one. Here you go. <laughs> uh, 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 all right, all right. I'll take that. Thank you very much. Okay, well, <laughs> can I have it? Okay, thank you. That's very nice. Good job. <laughs> Abbot, yeah, what about rings uh, in the water? Uh, 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 what about rings uh, in the water? Uh, 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 Can you get one? <gasps> uh, one. Good. Uh, 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 one. Uh, oh, there's one. Uh, I know. Yeah, you're way too small. Uh, okay. Wow. Uh, He's amazing. Uh, Good job. Uh, um, I don't know if they've done stuff with colors with uh, him uh, yet. Uh, uh, the macaws have done uh, some colors. Uh, I don't know about Abbott. Uh, but he definitely could. Uh, he absolutely could. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, uh, you guys want to see something else cool uh, that Abbott does? Uh, <laughs> Abbott, can you show them your weave? Can you weave? Weave. Oh. Oh. Camera. 
sounds scary. He stood up. Come here. You want to do super figure eight? Weave. He didn't catch it. Can you go to your platform. You catch. Wow, he's amazing. <laughs> Jump and catch. Catch in the air. Good job. All right, I think that's enough. I think that's enough. What's with his neck? Um, coconut is molting. Abbott might be molting a little bit, um, but him and Coconut pick at each other's necks sometimes. That's why he's missing some feathers on the back of his neck. Hi, Coconut. You want to catch some? Can you? Really high up. No. Ugh. Good catch. Here you go. Oh. Oh my god. Good catch. Coconuts. Uh, more afraid of people than Abbott is. All right. Sorry, the backpack doesn't like the vestibule. Can you see? Can you hear? Hello, testing. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello. Beachy one just gifted five tier one subs. Thank you for the five. Thank you so much. Um. I think we should raid into Alveus uh, before we do our fox training session here. We're going to do a training session with the foxes. Um, Beachy, thank you so much. Uh, we're going to do a training session with the foxes. Uh, hopefully, Lindsay comes up here soon so we can do that. Otherwise, we'll chill in the fox enclosure for a little bit and wait for her. But we are going to raid into Alveus. Don't go anywhere because uh, it's the exact same stream, just on the Alveus Sanctuary channel, um, which is the better one anyway. So, <laughs> don't go anywhere. Wow. Slide one resub for 26 months. Thank you for the 26 months. Um, yeah. Cool. Do, 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 why is the floor pebbles instead of dirt or grass? Uh, because it's easier to clean um, and it's better for their feet. We can't spray down grass, uh, but we can spray down pebbles. Keep it cleaner. Hi, Finn. All right, raiding into Alveus. Raiding into Alveus. Raiding into Alveus. If you want to see the foxes, stay for the raid. Hey, bud. You got it? Hello. Let me see if we're switching. Hey, Finn. Hi, Finn. Um. Hi, buddy. Fox tree house between these three trees. Cool. Yeah, that'd be great. Um, I don't. Has the raid? Oh, is it just starting? Oh, switching it over. Okay. All right, switching, swapping, switching, swapping, switching, swapping, switching. Hi. Just arrived. Hope you had a good stream. Well, stay here. Stay for the raid. Because the stream's not over. Oh. 
Okay. All right. Put, your <laughs> Put this in your backpack. I'm opening there. You stole my new gloves while you're there. All right. I just got here. I can't explain it any other way. <laughs> if that guy is not over here right now, I swear to God. All right, hey guys. I'm on the Alvaeus chat now. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, 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 hello. Look, it's Finn. Rook 40 just resubscribed for two months. Rook! Thank you for the two months. Beast, thank you for the prime. Beast 013 just subscribed. Hello. Um, here's Finn. Finn's an American red fox. Hello. He's not red because he was bred to be this color for the pet trade. Someone wanted him as a pet. He was born in captivity. Um, and he was confiscated by California Department of Fish and Wildlife, uh, because Level someone had them in his house. Subscribed. Thank you for the sub. A lot of new chatters this time. Hello, folks. Uh, if you're new to the channel, Alveus is a non-profit animal sanctuary and conservation education center in Central Texas. Uh, we rescue non-releasable animals like Finn, um, and teach people about these animals and where they came from. Uh, for foxes in particular, why you shouldn't have foxes as pets and also why you shouldn't wear furs. Furs uh, are cringe. Fur fashion is cringe, don't wear fur. Here he is pooping. That would happen in your house if he was your pet, but they're not pets. No foxes for you. The Gilexi just resubscribed for three months. Remember everyone, the fall carnival is November 4th. That's right. Peggy, thank you. Maya raided my stream with 745 viewers. Nice, I fell off. Do foxes growl or make audible sounds? Uh, yeah, foxes have a bunch of vocalizations. Uh, watch the pouch, he might be um, sniffing for it. <laughs> That's not for you, my friend. Um... Shoot, what was the question? Oh, they have a bunch of vocalizations. One of them, uh, foxes are notorious for sounding like a screaming woman in distress. <laughs> but they also do chattering. Um, they do, like, yapping at each other. Hello. I know I smell like crow kibble, but it's not fox kibble. We don't have treats for you right now. Yeah, sometimes they, sometimes they whine. Um... But they, they make lots of vocalizations. He is cute. Are we calling you? Um, yeah. It's hard to, it's really, it's, I don't know. It's hard to do keeping streams because they have like a whole job to do. Um, what I need to do with keeping streams is like, tell them, oh, she's coming is tell them like a time that I'm going to be in an enclosure doing something, but that's also really hard to do, you know, because of how things, like this morning it was like, oh, we should do a stompy bath, even though that wasn't in my like plan. But even then, like how long is mucking gonna take? I don't know, it depends. So it's, it's hard to plan out. We do our best. Hello. Yay, snacks. Yes. Uh. I gotta let her in. She's locked out. I know. Okay. I figured you could do the Sure. Hi, Finn. This is in the training. The crate? The kennel. And you can see how good he is. Kennel time, buddy. Shit, these things are so heavy. Yeah. All right. Let me get my 
pouch. Man, that love is hot. This pouch is hot. <laughs> It's a nice kennel. Yeah, it's a heavy duty son of a gun. They're expensive. <laughs> Hooray, bits. Thank you. There's some crow kibble in here. Now it's in my pocket. Delicious. So, Reed just. He's, touching you can do touch you can do paw you can do high five okay you can do uh, sit is paw underhand high fives overhand yeah okay and then uh touching just work on touching like right here on his chest Alrighty. okay um lindsay is gonna work with finn are the foxes allowed to get bones to chew on we have not okay. yeah we they do get whole prey so they they do eat bones but the whole prey that they get is like rats um and mice uh so it's not like a fat bone like a dog bone um maybe we can split the camera uh like put the a live cam on Lindsay working with finn and i'll be over here with reed hi reed would you like some snacks i have snacks can you come here bud i know there's a lot going on this is different reed here he is here he is We'll see how much, uh, we'll see how much Reed does with us today. Reed. Uh oh. Reed's afraid of Connor. Reed. Okay. He's also just like more shy than Finn is in general. You want more snacks? Okay. Here we go. Come here. That's so nice. Reed. Good job. Smart boy, you want to stay here? You could stay. Yeah, come here. That's nice. Come over here. That's so nice. Come here, bud. There he is. Yeah, you can stay here. Oh, that's okay. Thank you for your foot. Wasn't expecting that. Ew. Oh. The tattoos. The stream phone was on top of the tattoos all day. They stuck to me. Can you sit? Can you sit? Can you sit? Good job. Wow. Can I get your paw? Can I get your paw? Good job. Wow. Good boy, Reed. Can you sit? You sit. Sit. Good job. Can I have your paw? Good job. You got stuck on my ring. Can you sit? Can I have high five? High five? High five? High five? Good job. Can you sit? Can I touch? Good job. Thank you. You sit, touch. Thank you. That's nice. Can I have a paw? Good job. You sit, paw, 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 paw. Let me know when Good. you start running out. I'm like halfway through. Okay. Can you 
Can you sit? Can you touch? Wow. Amazing. Sit. Paw. Can you have your paw? Paw. 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 Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Can you sit? Sit. Touch. So the touching here, sit, touch, is not petting, because um, he clearly doesn't want to be like pet and scratched and loved on like a dog. Um, it's more so he's comfortable with us touching him in case we have to like treat a wound or give him an injection, come here, or check out his foot. So sit, paw, can I see your paw? And then the paw is not like high five like a dog. It looks very similar, but the purpose of that is also a husbandry behavior. Um, it's, can I look at your foot? Can I look at your nails? Do you need a nail trim? Sit, sit, touch. <laughs> um, so while it looks very similar and it does look like a dog behavior, uh, they're very different and the purpose is very different. Can I touch? Good. Does that make sense? Come here. Can you sit? Can you high five? Good job. That was very nice. So then it's high five, can I look at the underside of your paw? Do you have any cuts on the underside of your paw? Can you come over here? Can you sit? Can I touch? Touch. 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 Yeah, Mick. You're not joking about that. It's, there was a method to the, to the schedule today. Read. I have like three more, Lindsay. Okay. Read. You sit. Sit. Oh, he's standing. Scary. He's got ants on him. He's got to move. Just resubscribed for six months. A cool six months on here. Honeybee, thank you for the six months. Good boy. Can you sit? Can I have your paw? Good job. That's a nice paw. That's a nice paw. Two more. Can you sit? Can I have a high five? High five. Good job. That's very nice. All right, can I touch? Thank you. All right. Stealthy, I know you're joking, but don't do that. A lot of new chatters, they'll see that, and that's not good. All right. All right, buddy. You did really good, that's all. Well, there's actually, there's one more thing. Here you go, you just want this? You can have it for free. For you. But they aren't cats. I don't know what they're saying. Uh, they're, they're pretty cat-like for, for a canine, or a canid. Um, but they are canids. They're more related to dogs than they are cats, for sure. Pretty good, Reed. Yeah. I'll get his food for the day. His diet. Hi, Finn. Yeah. So brave. Sorry. 3003 just resubscribed wow. for two months. Yeah. Wow. It's nice in there. <laughs> He's like, don't touch that door. This is a uh, fox diet. Fox kibble, scrambled egg, sweet potato, apple, zucchini, carrot, uh, sweet pea. Here you go, buddy. This for you. For you. Scrambled egg. Here, I'll give you some ASMR, but Connor has to stay there because he'll be scared. What do you think?
Um, yeah, foxes are pretty opportunistic. They'll eat lots of stuff. They're omnivores. So they'll eat um, like rats and mice and lizards and birds in the wild, but they'll also eat berries um, and insects even. They'll catch bugs in here and eat them. Um, eggs. They love scrambled egg. Uh, dates for when next streamers are visiting Alves. I do not have a date, but I think the next one is Alex. I think. Yes. Yes. Is Finn's food in kennel? Yeah. He's eating in there. So that he builds a positive association with the kennel. Kennel is good. Yeah, Alex. Alex. We stream from. No, I will not stream from TwitchCon. I won't do IRLs at TwitchCon. Um, but the Alveus panel will be uh, streamed on Twitch. On Nom Noms or something? I don't know. Some Twitch. Some Twitch random channel. More VTubers? I'm down to do more VTubers. Yeah, we'll see. I don't know any VTuber. I've never talked to any VTubers besides Fillion now, so. We'll see. There's a time. Uh, the, that's what the anime girl was. It's called a VTuber. Is that like a new YouTube? I don't know what VTuber, I don't know the origin. Is it virtual YouTuber? Maybe, it's a decent guess. I don't know. Do you have exhibit floor meet and greets? Yeah, yeah, Cutie has one. Well, I'm doing the one with Cutie, so it's me and Cutie yeah, together, cool. and then um, the one that Alvis did. and I have a meet yeah. and greet as well. There's more of that? Oh, yeah. Oh, jeez. It's huge. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's huge. Interesting. There's like a bunch of them. Virtual YouTuber is what people are saying. Interesting. Fillion was so fun. Yeah, she was. She was great. Yeah, I would love Sea Dog to come here. I don't know if Sea Dog comes to Texas. I'm not sure why he would. We'll see. We will see. Yeah, he's killing it. He needs encouragement to stay in sometimes. The whiplash between the Trihex and Fillion collab is funny. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it is funny. Um, it's quite an adjustment for me. It's like being a teacher, but every time you have a class, it's like a vastly Alan, different age group and classroom but you just and you have very little information about it before you start <laughs> that's how it feels Mr. Crunch face over there. there will not be an Alvaeus booth at TwitchCon there will be an Alvaeus panel um, and a meet and greet oh, good job, are, so are they? I never even thought about it. Last, when, when we looked at it, 2019, for the EF, Good boy. I think it was like 15 or 20k just for like the booth, and you had to rent like through them another like 5 to 10k worth. Of I guess because it's for vendors, it's like for you to yeah. sell something, so it's not for like a, a streamer, because that would make no sense. If I was like, here, Twitch, here's 20k so I can have a booth at TwitchCon, that would make no sense. Good job, then. Wow, he's, he's sitting so in there. <laughs> Has Finn peed in the new crate yet? He's peed and pooped. He's peed and pooped in the new crate. He poops in it every day, the market says. It's what he does. All right, let's walk back to the studio. <laughs> I gotta... I just ask, like, donation box. We cannot take physical cash donations. Oh, there. they're also... Yeah. I, People can't do that. Honestly, we would also... Huh? Can you wait and help me? Yeah. Pick that out? Yeah. Um, yeah, if you're going to TwitchCon, don't give us physical cash donations. We've also never done donations physically. We'd probably walk home with like 20 bucks <laughs> anyway, so it would not be worth it. I think, yeah, people would like write checks and stuff. Oh. Uh, and I would have to like. But those were like adults. Right. You're not going to have like an 18 year old come up and write a check and be like, I love what you guys are doing. Thank you so much. <laughs> just, just the few out there that might, you know. You're doing great. It's things. a security thing, but also it's a, like a tracking 
thing, so you keep everything online, it's way more uh, it's easier for us to be transparent. That transparent. Way. Yeah. Thank you. Are you done, Reed? If you're done, I'm gonna take the bowl so Ben doesn't chew on it. I'll grab it. Reed, you don't want this? He's not done. Why is he not done? <laughs> I don't know. Jared, you need to eat it, otherwise Ben will chew it. He's eating it, he's eating it. Here's proof. Um, I'll probably, or I will probably vlog at TwitchCon, just on my phone though, nothing crazy. I know. Ah! <laughs> Hi, bud. You don't need to do that. <laughs> you don't have to do that. Ben, how about you go back ben. there? Look at all that. Ben, come here. Come here. You still have food. Reed, here you go. You want to finish your food in peace? Okay, yeah, fine. Take it away. <laughs> I like, put the bowl down and he grabbed it and he moved like three feet back. He was like, I'll just eat it over here. Thank you. Do you vlog LA Gala? Yeah, uh, that vlog is getting posted tomorrow. It had to get edited together and I did a voiceover for it yesterday. Oh, a sweet pea, yum. Good job, buddy. It's good that you ate that. Okay, he ate everything except a squash and a carrot and a piece of pea. That's not, as long as he eats all of his kibble. Yeah, he did. That's what I'm like worried about. Cool. So he'll stay at a the bowl. same weight, if not more. Okay, sir, can we take this? Okay. Sorry. <laughs> Wanna shut it? Hi, bud. We take the bowls because you're amazing. This is so heavy and awkward. It's so awkward. I kept hitting my ankles. It does that. There is some pieces that we dropped in. Nice. With the giant all. all right. Yay! Hooray! Thank you, Lindsay. Good stuff. Do you want me to lock him? Sure. Yay! Boys. Fox boys. How was Abbott? Excellent. Easy peasy. He uh, got rings from the water. Wow. And put them on today pretty Talk cool he's amazing he was afraid of connor he's afraid of the camera yeah 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 let's see how he does um chat i need to film at 2 30. uh Five minutes. Perfect timing. um so we'll put you guys on night cams for today um and then things coming up uh what's coming up we're not doing anything tomorrow, right? No, Saturday. It'll just be you and Ella tomorrow. Okay. Um it should be me and Ella tomorrow. Um 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 Ella Sunday. Right. As well, but that's normal. And then next week uh, I don't know what's on the calendar, dude. We have TwitchCon. Yeah, I mean TwitchCon is coming up next weekend. 
Um, but before that, I will have, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's, what's happening next week. There's a calendar. Um, there's a calendar. Uh, and then events that are coming up. We have a Siren plushie launch on October 28th. So that's careful. Ooh, that's going to be after TwitchCon. Um, and then the fall carnival is right after that, November 4th. Um, also, thank you. Um, Superstars and Animal Quest happen when we get back from TwitchCon as well. So all of that is happening. All of that is happening. Like before the end of this month somehow. Or like plus a little bit of the beginning of next month. Busy time. Yeah. But it's okay. Yeah, it's a busy time. Things are crazy. All good things. It is the last Animal Quest. You're right. Holy moly. The last Animal Quest is on the Scorpions. Is coming up. And I say it's the last Animal Quest because it's the last ambassador that I have to do an Animal Quest on. If we get more ambassadors, then I'll probably do an Animal Quest for that ambassador. Um, but then at the end of November, instead of another Animal Quest, it'll be a Creature of Habit, which is new show that I will be working on this upcoming month. Thank you. So, yeah. Okay, guys, people claps for Connor because he cameramaned all day. F's for the tattoos. Pain, sticky. I don't like the way they feel anymore. <laughs> but they've been on for like overnight. Um, so. All right. I'm switching out the night cams. I'll see you later. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Go watch the night cams.